Estamos de vuelta en este programa especial de Top 20 MTV Hits desde el MTV Winter en Valencia y tenemos aquí a las estrellas del cartel My Chemical Romance. Hi guys, how are you? Very good, how are you? Good. How does it feel for you guys to be back in Spain? Because I know you were here a bit, only a bit ago. Yeah, yeah, it's it's great. You know, uh, I think uh, we've been on tour. Uh, we've been on tour for a while now, and we've had the best weather here. I mean, I know it was raining all day today, but it's still the best weather we've had <laughs> yeah, so it's far. Really beautiful here. Yeah. Had you heard about this venue before? Uh, we just saw a picture very recently. We had, uh, maybe a little bit about it, but we've never been to Valencia, so uh, it, we were like blown away when we saw the photos of where we were playing. So, <laughs> what's so special about this this gig for you guys? It's always fun to to go to a place that you've never been to before and, and play a huge show. You know, um, so I'm really excited about the it's Carnival, right? And I mean that's like your Halloween basically, and my and Halloween in the States is my favorite holiday. So yeah. I mean, I'm kind of excited about that. What would be your favorite Halloween costume? Oh, uh, I was uh, I was Freddy Krueger for like five years in a row. <laughs> <laughs> and you retired him. I had to. Yeah. My favorite. I was the Steve of Marshmallow Man, and my my grandmother made me the costume. And it was awesome. The one from Ghostbusters. Yeah, yeah. yeah big Marshmallow Man. Uh, I was a ninja. That was my favorite. For five years running as well. Or? Uh, two years. <laughs> two years. I was a ninja. What about you, Ray? Uh, Optimus Prime from. Uh, Transformers from the original cartoon series. You guys should have worn those outfits tonight. It would have yeah, been no, we didn't cool. think of it. We should have Halloween. We had to move our luggage down to really small duffel bags because it was a small flight. Uh, yeah, so. we wouldn't have room for underwear. And if I was like a ninja, you wouldn't see me. And uh, speaking of costumes and everything, uh, how is the tour for Danger Days different from the Black Parade right. tour? Uh, it's a lot different. I mean, I think the the Black Parade tour was, you know, we were we were telling that story every night. So we played uh, the record from front to back, and it was very, you know, theatrical. I think, uh, you know, uh, it was a, it was about the the bombastic, like you know, uh, set pieces and costumes. And this is just really just about the the band and the music that the band has made. You know, more laid back. Well, we totally like the look for the the whole Danger Days concept and everything, and we're gonna refresh our viewers' uh, memories with the first video awesome. from the album Danger Days. Nine Na, 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 na. How many nanas is it? Is it? Nine. It's supposed to be like 57, but yeah. we ended up just cutting it down to nine. I don't remember why either. Na, 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 na. Let's keep going. Yeah. Well, let's check out. Vamos a ver el video de na, 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 y seguimos con My Chemical Romance después. Seguimos aquí con My Chemical Romance. Um, guys, for the record, what's exactly the concept behind the fabulous Killjoys? Um, well, you know, it, it's a record. The record just has a high concept. Uh, a pirate radio station in 2019, um, kind of opposed to this corporation that just cleans everything up, and that's that's just all it is. There's no story. There's no characters to really follow. We're technically just playing ourselves in 2019. But in the video for Sing, it's a continuation of yes, Na Na Na. Are there going to be yeah. more videos where the, the story continues? Although you die in both videos. We do, yeah. Will you have a resurrection for a third? There'll be a third video. Yes, we just don't know which, like, when exactly that's going to come. We feel we have some time now to breathe, and we don't have to keep doing the story videos. We'll wait. When the time's right, we'll make that one. And, and where did you get the ideas for the villains, uh, minions, with those creepy masks? I just started with a word. I just made up a word, and it was Draculoids. And then I was like, all right, well now I got to figure out what that is. So I, I found that mask on eBay. Yeah, he had this mask from this from the 70s. Yeah, and it was just this perfect face. It was uh, everything about it. It had like this eternal scream, and it was vintage looking, and it was just the perfect face for a Draculoid. So, which are the hardest songs for you to perform on stage? For me, Black Parade. Black Parade's a hard one. It's you know that's a, that's an epic song. Yeah. Um, but you were saying too, there was a song that we have called Death Wish. That's oh, a yeah. really high register. The whole so time. Yeah. Do you rehearse for them in any special way, or is? Just... Well, you know, we just play a lot on stage. I mean, we do a lot of a long sound check. We just stand up there, and it takes you know your voice all for all of us like three, four songs to break in anyway. So you don't really start sounding good till your fifth or sixth. So, um, so we try to do at least a half hour to an hour of a sound check. Going back just a bit to the Black Parade, did you guys actually become a bit exhausted from doing the whole theatrics every night? And because I imagine it must have been yeah. grueling to do. Yeah, the we, had a, we had a pretty crazy schedule, and uh, those costumes were pretty thick. Yeah. yeah. It, to it's any doing anything every night the same way for two two years yeah. and change, it, think, it gets a little. Dumb. Yeah, that was more of it. I think yeah. more mental, you know, physically exhausting, but more mentally, like you, you felt like you were doing the same thing every single day. You know, so, kind of like being in cats. Like Groundhog's Day yeah. or something. Yeah. <laughs> so that's why you deliberately kind of toned it down for this tour, where it's just 
guys playing rock music. It's not. Yeah, it's been a while since I think people have gotten to see just the band and 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 appreciate the you know, the songs that we've written throughout the the band's career. I mean, we've been together for 10 years now, so we got a lot of songs. Well, this is a top 20 show, but we're gonna let you just choose any video from any era that you'd like to any watch. Any video you want. Right okay. Now. Well, my my favorite video, I think it's a collective favorite video of all time, is uh, "Sabotage" by the Beastie Boys. Directed by the great Spike Jones. Ahí lo habéis visto, uno de los vídeos más sensacionales que hemos puesto en este canal, Sabotage de los Beastie Boys. Laura. Yo quiero preguntarles un poquito sobre España y lo que saben de nuestro país. Guys, you've been here plenty of times. Our fans are interested in knowing if you've tried paella. Oh yeah, oh. We, we, um, we get we back in Jersey. We get really good paella back there. There's a place called Spanish Tavern in, in Belleville. It's amazing paella. Do you know any words in Spanish? A bit, un poquito. Uh, Ray, well, yeah, I'm, yeah. I, I know a little bit. Un, un poquito. Un poquito. Is what I always say. Yeah. And you just mentioned Jersey. Uh, what do you guys think of Jersey Shore and the impact it's had on the world promoting <laughs> the wonderful? It's just kind of funny. People. I don't have any problem with it. I just don't enjoy the show. It's boring. I, I think uh, I think that's the first thing we should show when. And extra terrestrials come to Earth, and then people. This is Where what we, you know, this is what around. our our planet has to offer. I think that'd be, you know, or, or put it in like some sort of time capsule that they bury until you know civilization dies out, and then they can find that again. I think that'd be a really good idea. Well, I think our time's up, isn't it? Are we running out of time? It seems like ah, los sentimos mucho. Ya nos estamos quedando sin tiempo. Los chicos se tienen que ir a prepararse para dar el gran concierto esta noche en el MTV Winter de Valencia, que podréis ver en MTV a partir de las 12 este sábado. Uh, guys, we're wrapping up. Uh, we're gonna oh. say good. Good luck. Way. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you very so much. much. Enjoy the rest of the tour. Uh, we'll let you say goodbye to the fans in your way. Adios. <laughs> Adios. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye.